Welcome back to Afternoon Drive here on Chopper Radio. My name is Drew Mulholland. Hope you're all having a uh, very nice Thursday afternoon, almost to the weekend. And I have tomorrow off, so I am already there. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, you guys all have the week off. The Newburyport Baseball Squad is in the house. How are you guys? we got Mike Toomey. You can wave, Mike. There you go. Casey McLaren in the middle. Thomas Murphy, uh, who I believe is the only guy who hasn't been on the show before. Am I right, Thomas? Yes. I've had these two guys on before another... Uh, well, anyway, so let's start with you, Thomas. How are you? Nice of you to be here. I'm good. There you go. Yeah, Thank see, you. Casey knows the drill. You just grab that microphone, and when you want to talk, you can't break it. You can break it, as Tyler always reminds me. Stop telling people that. They can break it, but you probably won't. Uh, good to see you. So what's, uh, where have you been? You've been avoiding us. Uh, I just been here. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just kidding with you. Uh, what's up, guys? Baseball season. You had a game today, off and running uh, on the season. Uh, today didn't go so great. Why don't we get that out of the way? What happened today? Who wants it? Yep. <laughs> uh, they got some timely hits. Uh, we made some errors in the field, and we didn't get hits of our own. So that was the story of the day. Good. You've had We're trying to put it past us, and now it is. <laughs> there you go. You want to move on already, huh? Yeah. Um, Casey, you had the uh, – I was reading. You had a big uh, pitching performance earlier in this season. Yeah. Uh, was that a week ago? A bit of a gem, right? Yeah, against Masco. Against Masco. Always nice to uh, pitch well against Masco. Of course. Just one of those days you had it going? Yeah, uh, fastball's working well. Um, curveball, too, for the top of the order. Um, what was that? Was that a one nothing uh, game? Or it was a close game, two right? 2-1 game. 2-1 game, But, yeah. Uh, yeah. All right. Extra innings? No, nah, we were Fun. up 2 nothing going to the final, and then they got... They got a run. Did you go the distance? Yeah. Oh, good for you. Yeah. Very nice. And let's talk a little bit about uh, with Mike Toomey here. Mike, uh, he's a – you probably remember Casey from basketball. Uh, Mike was one of the uh, hockey guys we've had on the show before. Uh, and you probably can't see it, but Mike is in a uh, – what, what is that, an air cast? Or, uh, it's, it's not good, whatever it is. What happened to you? I uh, tore my meniscus. Not uh, good. I took, like, a leg check at the end of the hockey season. And then it was, like, fine. And then the beginning of baseball – just gave out on me. No. Yeah. So I had to have surgery, like, first week, and it takes, like, three three months until sports. Three months? Yeah. So you're kind of just uh, hanging around right now for a little bit? Yeah, I'm just a cheerleader. <laughs> Could, uh, how long is the end of the season again? Can you get back for any tournament play? Or uh, I don't think you so. You think you're in trouble? Yeah. yeah. In that regard. Well, you had to get, so you got, did you play in the tournament game for hockey? Yeah. So it's, it literally happened. Yeah. At the end of that. And yep. Hmm. All right, and this is a recurring injury? Uh, no, no, it, it's, it's, yeah, it just happened. It's the first first time you've ever had this leg injury there. Yeah. No, oh, well, I'm sorry to hear that, man. Uh huh. Let's go going out with a uh, going out with a bang. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> season. Well, last season. What are you trying bomb. to do for? Uh, you, I know you said cheerleader, but is there any uh, <laughs> any ways you can kind of help these guys? Uh, I'm sure you're seeing some, baseball is one of those sports where you can, can actually really help from the uh, from the dugout, you know. Yeah, just try to be like a positive influence on the team. Some young guys making the same mistakes you used to make out there or something? Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Let me stop this right away yeah. here, young fella. Yeah. Uh, all right, pretty good. Casey, must, uh, you guys must hate seeing that happen to one of your uh, veteran players there to start a season. But Yeah, it's definitely too bad. Um, Mike was a big part of the team last year, and we're missing him this year. Yeah. Um, Tom, what's it like to see, uh, to see one of the guys go down before the uh, – season even really gets rolling it was really sad to see because like mike put in the most like work probably over the off season and yeah. like he was probably the most dedicated to this upcoming season yeah. like he was the only junior captain we had last year and um he was just like a really big leader for us so it was definitely like really tough to see him go down everybody said that about you in the hockey locker room too you were like one of the uh one of the locker room leaders on the hockey side too so that's good. You can still be that, I guess, right? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Um, so what's the uh, what's the record right now, boys? Young season? We're three and two right now. Three and two. All right, good little start. We had a good little laugh off the air because I had the uh, Pentucket baseball guys in on Tuesday. Uh, they were also coming off a loss, which again is the radio show jinx here. I guess don't book the radio show in the afternoon if you got a morning game. <laughs> um, but uh, I told uh, you were talking about. Uh, Would you ask Casey? You asked if. Pete Cleary was on the show, which he was. Yeah. And you, you were. I think you, you we set it up perfectly because you took him deep last year. You wanted to make mention <laughs> of that. <laughs> Maybe. See, the uh, it's fu it's funny because these guys were all talking about they do enjoy beating Newburyport, so you guys haven't had a chance to get back at them, which is pretty funny. Um, actually, it happened last year though, so 
What was that? It didn't happen last year. So. <laughs> oh, gotcha. <laughs> Actually, There's they no joy out of it, they were they were pretty uh, they were pretty funny in regards to uh, saying that not much good happened in general to them last yeah. year. So, uh, <laughs> so they they were a good group. If of that guys. was almost <laughs> us. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we really can't say anything to that. Did you guys made that? That was it last year. You guys made like that big run at the end of the year, though. Yeah. yeah. That was like crazy. You were it was. How made the way through the season? It was like you guys weren't going anywhere, and then you made this crazy tournament run. I know. What was that all about? I think we just pulled it together. Like, yeah, we we knew we were better than our record. I think we were what, three and ten at one point. At one point we were one and nine, weren't we? One and eight. Yeah, we were. You guys were one and eight. Yeah. One and one and eight. Uh, it was one one wow. and seven. Two, two and, and nine. nine. Three oh, and ten. Yeah. <laughs> Numbers you remember. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, that's yeah. That was quite the come. I, uh, what's your coach's name again? I'm sorry, I'm blanking on his name. Uh, Mark Rowe. Mark Rowe. Yeah. So what's it, what's he thinking when he's got a team like? That he knows is better than three and ten. How does yeah. he get it going? Well, so he he did like this saying like let's just go one and zero today like because you know it was a little daunting to, like look I've at, heard that one before. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just to like look at seven games and then yeah. I think we had Linfield right in the middle that we knew we had to beat them, and somehow we did. I mean, not really somehow. Yeah. Like after the game today, <laughs> yeah. I say somehow. Yeah. But, yeah that um, was Linfield who got you today. Yeah. Yeah. What was the score? Seven nothing. So, but um. Yeah, we just like bought into what he was saying and um, took it a game at a time, and then all of a sudden, you know, we're just a couple away and we knew we were gonna do it. Yeah, and then once you kind of get it cooking, it just uh, it's a nice little thing to be a part of, huh? Definitely. Thomas, what was that like coming? I mean, I know you get a couple wins, you get a winning streak going, and then you're like, we can. When do you start to believe? When you get to that five win mark, or I don't know, did you believe the whole time? I don't know. Um, we were kind of like we were winning. Couple, we won like two games for Linfield, and then once we got that win, and Casey had like a really good game, we were just really confident, especially when yeah. he was pitching. Did you guys know you had it within that group? I mean, it's you kind of you always want to say that, but I mean, it's, when you really look at it, you're three and ten chances of making the tournament are like, I don't know, I'm no math guy, but it's not great. Mm -hmm. You know, we knew we wanted to like make something special happen. Yeah. Um, I, mean, I don't I don't know if we realized it until we beat Linfield though. How much? Uh, how what did you lose for seniors this year? Um, Kenny. We lost Kenny, who was our catcher. Um, is that Kenny Hodge? Yeah, Kenny Hodge. Kenny? Yeah. He was the catcher and the goalie, huh? Yeah. yeah. Backstop that to, man. Yeah, he likes to block things. <laughs> <laughs> he likes to block things. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Um, Has Chris he ever blocked Holiday. a jump shot of yours, or? No way. I, I'm not sure if I've ever. <laughs> I'm not sure I've ever seen him on the basketball court. <laughs> yeah, not not his. He <laughs> sticks to ice, yeah. huh? There you go. Yeah. Um, all right. Well, who's catching this year? Uh, Nick White. He's Nick a sophomore. White. Nick White is okay. Yeah. How many young guys you got got starting? Um, quite a few. Yeah. 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 Who else? Um, Archer. Ryan Archer. Ryan, yeah, Archer. Ryan Archer. Hockey Archer. guy. No, yeah. basketball guy. No, no hockey. hockey. Yeah. You're thinking okay. of Archie. Oh, Archie. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. 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 There's two Ryan it's Archies and uh, Ryan Archer. Yeah, ne Welcome now I will officially never get that right. Now I will. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> both great players in their own right. Yeah. Um, what's the. Uh, is it has it been a struggle? It hasn't been that bad of a winter. Were you guys able to get out on the field in good enough time and stuff? And is it better than most winters into springs? Yeah. Yeah. Um, like last year, we didn't really have any scrimmages. Yeah. Um, this this year we had like six scrimmages before our first game. Yeah. yeah. So then, you know, game one, first time in the box, you've seen live pitching, so that yeah. helped. And last year we didn't really have that, so. Yeah. Compared to last year, like we're kind of. Mid-season form. Beautiful. Compared to last year. Maybe if now you won't start whatever. We won't even talk <laughs> about it. Never mind. Exactly. Yeah. Um, it must be refreshing to yeah. to get that three, you know, be above 500 early on, though, and kind of not dig yourself that hole. Um, Mike, I wonder, what's the uh, what's the mentality with you? Like, I have seen it's good of you to be on here. I can tell, I can tell you're not the uh, kind of guy that would kind of bail on a season anyway, but I have seen it before. When uh, you know an upperclassman gets hurt, you're a senior, right? Yeah. I've seen it before when a, like a senior gets hurt in that spring season, and you know what? I'm just gonna go and uh, eventually go to the beach here and uh, <laughs> and do stuff that isn't baseball practice. Um, how important it's is to kind of be that guy that's you know a leader and st sticks with these guys though throughout it. Oh um, yeah, when it happened, like I really wouldn't know what else to do. <laughs> like yeah. I'm just like love sports, so I like yeah. whole high school career. So just yeah. to be out on the field makes me happy are you uh have the coaches said anything to you like looking at you like an assistant coach sort of thing oh uh, yeah they're, they're happy i'm out there they're happy you're there <laughs> good but they're like no coaching from you is it <laughs> <laughs> yeah who, who are the uh who are the pitchers this year besides you casey um me and parker and then 
Tom your brother's, Murphy, yeah. your brother's pitcher too in Tom. Yeah, yeah. Murph. Um, I'm not trying to like jinx him, but <laughs> it's a zero point zero. <laughs> yeah. he, he did. He did just punch you. So yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, a zero point zero ERA, Tom. Oh my god. Yes. So far, so so far. Oh yeah. yeah. Don't worry. There's no such thing as radio jinx. It's fine. Got, got like three innings pitched. Let's talk about yeah. it. How, how come you're unstoppable? What's going on? I've only pitched like four innings in my career, probably. Yep. So, like yeah, so last year I didn't pitch at all, and okay. then my sophomore year I pitched like two innings and, two and now, garbage and now you're time. Shut down reliever. Uh, I mean no, but hopefully <laughs> yeah. Man, well, would you like to, Mike? You'd like to add something? I yeah. see. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Murph, he throws gas, and that, <laughs> that he has a knee buckler curveball. Yeah. Do you Mostly throw hard? Or is this sarcasm? Handle. I'm sorry. What? Do you throw hard or is this sarcasm? He, he throws hard. You do throw hard. Okay. Yeah. Every once in a while, he mixes in like a knuckle. It's like it's crazy. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I thought we were going. I actually. Oh, well, I have to ask you guys this. Pentucky guys really disappointed me the other day. Have you guys all seen the movie Major League? No. no? <laughs> oh, Tyler. <laughs> no. <laughs> Wait. What is it like about? Wild thing. Rick Vaughn. Oh, I've 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 seen like clips of. Uh, You've seen clips. No, <laughs> no, no, <laughs> no, no. Been no. The fastball, like, yeah, like yeah. Through the net. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, there's more to the three-hour movie than that, though. <laughs> My goodness. None of you guys have seen Major League? No. Nah. I'll watch yeah. it tonight. Yes, please Maybe, do. Maybe, yeah. You got, I don't really remember it's like, from movie what? names too well. So is The Godfather. Okay. The classics. The Godfather was a lot earlier, yeah. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just making a point, Tyler, okay? All right. Yeah, you guys should watch it. It's very good. Well, my point about that was what I was thinking that if you did throw off speed stuff, there's a scene in that movie... I'm talking about scenes now every day of Major League. I'm trying to get the kids to watch it. It's brutal. It's really, I know, I should get paid from them. Um, there's a scene where the guy comes out and he says uh, says to the reliever who's like older and, you know, struggling, he goes, uh, what do you want, Skip? You want me to go with the off-speed stuff? And coach looks at him and goes, you got anything else? And he goes, no. <laughs> well, let's go with that. <laughs> you know? Yeah, that's basically me. That's where <laughs> That is you? You're not? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm not like old reliever that doesn't happen. You're the old reliever? <laughs> <laughs> Well, that's good. And a uh, 0. 0.00 ERA. Oh God, yeah. A lot of junk. That's fantastic. It can, can be effective. Um, what, what's the uh, schedule? Would you guys get any more games here during vacation week? We had one Thursday, scheduled. Right? We had one scheduled for Saturday that got rained okay. out to Monday. What's um, the? Uh, is it weird playing these morning games during vacation week? Not really. It just seems like a weekend like yeah. game that we have every once in a while. Yeah. But um. It's nice to get it like done early. Yeah, Wiz Parker. Parker hasn't been on the show. I don't think he came. He maybe once. Did he come on once? One. Yeah, once. Yeah. I think. yeah. Parker. Was, uh, Parker's a little awkward. So. <laughs> 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 uh, uh, Casey, would you agree with that? You might probably know more than most. I mean, a little bit. He's gotten, be- he's gotten better. <laughs> what a basketball year he had, huh? <laughs> yeah, he had a good year. You guys were. Uh, you, I mean, you were obviously uh, some of this. Uh, congratulations, by the way, on on Tufts. I see Thank you. Uh, sweatshirt there. Um, that'll be fun. They get you. Uh, you do you, uh, can they contact you? Are you already getting basketball calls this time of year? Are you um, telling you to stay in shape or that sort of stuff? I don't know. I like tried to reach out for like a workout plan, but they can't. Like do NCAA that rules. Yeah, they can't do Good that. Good job, yet. Tufts. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. They're following. Yeah, yeah. yeah. well, yes, the rules. I would say they have to. Yeah. Um, but yeah, that must be exciting though, huh? Playing yeah. some big time basketball. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Do you know any? Do you have you like met the guys, or is it one of those things you all just kind of show up on day one? Yeah, no, I, I've gone down there a few times. Yeah. to play pickup. Cool. Yeah, that's good. Um, we saw the uh, actually, Mike. Did you know you might have played with them growing up? I was wondering with the Frozen Four that just passed. Did you play with the uh, Mirages? Um, no, that was our what were we eighth grade? Yeah, we're, yeah. no seventh. He, he he actually he's was in like, your brother's grade, right? Yeah. yeah, he was um he was on my Pioneer B League championship. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh yeah. When, Good. Yeah. You uh, say that with a big smile. Yeah. There's a, some trophy that Qu- year. Quick little story. Okay. Like, this is Ben Mirages, by the way. He played for Providence in the Frozen Four, and he was a new report guy for one year, new report high school guy for one year. Sorry, go ahead. Um, so in the championship game, it was Murph's team versus my team. This is what year are we talking about? Uh, what were you? We're about like nine. It's B, B League. Yeah. B League championship. This, like is, ten. this is seven like, years ago? No. A while Five. ago. Yeah, I really it's probably about like, like eight or ten years ago. Yeah. Eight or ten years ago, just, okay. Just picture miniature Murph and miniature Mike. <laughs> yeah. And then, right. bi- and then big Ben, Ra- ben Mirages. Yeah. So mm-hmm. it's a championship game. He throws gas like no one can really hit it. Murph's dad's we're talking co- baseball. Okay. I yeah, we're yeah, talking yeah. Hockey. No, we're talking baseball. Oh. <laughs> Murph's dad's a coach, okay. and Pioneer League has like inning lim- inning li- innings limits. Yeah. So, um, like a pitcher can only go like four innings, 
and like Ben like happened to pitch a lot of innings in the playoffs. <laughs> <laughs> they were all counted up at the end though. <laughs> oh, okay, it's su- suspect, suspect. So they won, but we, we don't really. You guys know are how. still bitter about this. Yeah. Is like an asterisk on this one. Yeah, there's an asterisk. <laughs> so, did, but you guys never played hockey with him though. No. 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 Was he a whole four or five years older than no. you? No, 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 he's two. He's two. Two years. Right. Because is he only a sophomore there? Yes. He is. Yeah. Oh wow. He also played in like a lot of. Hey, grab that. Just grab the mic there. He played in like a lot of select teams, like stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, so he didn't okay. really play too much with the report until. Yeah, he, he just the, did the freshman year, right? Yeah. But uh, yeah, it was kind of it was kind of cool to see him on uh, ESPN and yeah. all that stuff. I watched him play in my brother's like middle school hockey team, like yeah. way back, and because my brother and him were in the same grade. Yeah. And like back you, then, watching you knew him, right then, did you? Just, it was absolutely ridiculous. You could be a hockey scout. You knew right then he was going to be a uh, <laughs> anyone could have known NHL draft pick. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> yeah, he was—he was something special. But uh, they got—they got knocked out. Went to a good school, in Providence. It's, yeah, uh, I, I lived in Providence for many years. Good little—it's uh, a real big basketball town, actually. Yeah. You ever been to a Friars game out there? Kid? Never a Providence game. I've seen games at their court, like the um, dunk. Yeah, Chris Dunn, right? Chris Dunn. Yeah, yeah he's a big yeah. point guard. No, right? well, I saw um, they had March Madness games down in Providence. Oh like, yeah, a couple years ago, like yep. Yale versus Baylor and uh, Duke versus UNC Wilmington, I think. Yep. So that was the only time I've been down there. You went down for that, yeah. yeah. It's a good. Uh, I did. That's one thing I didn't realize about there was they. Uh, it's a good hockey town too, but like basketball is the big. You know they don't have football, so basketball is kind of their big program, and it's a really big basketball city. So yeah, they they struggled last year, but like the last couple of years they've been a top twenty five program. Yeah, their coach is a good dude. Yeah, Ed, uh, Ed Cooley, yeah. rebuilding year this year, but. Um, and you get to uh, now you get to jump into the college ball aspect. So that's it. How's your how's your bracket? This is probably your last bracket you could do, right? Now you're a collegiate athlete. You can't do any more brackets. <laughs> My bracket. <laughs> then you won some money. Yeah, I won some money. You won some money. There you go. Yeah. Good for you. The. Yeah. Um, Mine was terrible. How'd you how'd you win? Do you have the winner? Do you have Virginia? I had Virginia. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Yeah. yeah, you kind of have to have the winner in those yeah. things, right? I had the. Um, I had a. Uh, who did I have? I had UNC winning. Oh. No good. No good, but yeah. uh, anyway, I got I digress. What's the uh, what's the best part of this uh, baseball squad for you guys this year? Is it the uh, camaraderie? Is it the pasta parties? Is it uh, I don't know what is it? Honestly, like compared to last year, it's just like everyone is kind of like in in it, and no one's uh, like taking a back seat and like yeah. taking like a lesser role. Like, was that a weird crew to gel last year? Is that part of the reason why you guys got off to a rough start? Was it just a um, a group that wasn't? Uh, not really. It's just we didn't really like click at the beginning, and yeah. we weren't playing really good baseball. But this year, like everyone's like into the games, and everyone's showing up to practice and like ready to go, and nice. everyone's looking forward to it. So baseball's a weird sport too. I mean, look at the Red Sox, right? They got a, their team hasn't changed that much from last year, but right now they can't buy a win. You know, it's 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 tough. Yeah. Baseball's a weird game. It plays mental tricks on you. You know, yeah. it's kind of like golf. It's if you're if you're in a slump hitting, it's really nobody can bail you out. You got to find your own way out of it, right? Yeah. What, you had one of those before, Mike? You're like, yes, sir. <laughs> he knows all about it. <laughs> but how do you get out of your uh, out of your slumps over the years, Mike? What's the uh, – uh, um, Like, as much as you want to, like, think about it, like, the best thing is just to, like, not think and just, like, trust your instincts. Not thinking work for you? Yeah. Yeah. Good. Because if you overthink it, too many too many thoughts in your mind, you just make more mistakes. There's an aspect of that. like me throwing a first base. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you have you thrown a first base? Pi- yeah, the pitcher struggles yeah. throwing a first. Uh, you're John Lester. Yeah, the yips. Yeah. Oh man, <laughs> how is? I'm actually three for three this year, but like throwing to first. Yeah, if yeah. you see the Spikes throws, they're like, like that. Are they're you getting uh, flicks? Now, is it? Let me ask you this: Is it uh, if it's like a? Is it easier for you if it's a close play? Like it's gonna be a bang bang. No, play? it's harder because you see him getting up the line and then you rush your throw. Really? Okay. Yeah. Because I thought that was the deal with the yips, though. Like, it's only a problem, like, when you know you got all day. Oh, no. But no, it's For just, me, it's the opposite. So it's more just the angle thing. Yeah. He actually almost got uh, Parker, like, killed. Yeah, killed, basically. <laughs> his, tor- his meniscus almost ripped in half. <laughs> Parker, by the way, is uh, Casey McLaren's brother, Parker McLaren. So we should clarify that. Um, it's a bad throw to first. And no, it was just Casey. I like, took my time, yeah. I think, too much. <laughs> Casey thinks about the throw and to first base too so much. I took my time too much, and then... I don't know, the Masco kid, like, stepped on Parker's, like, Achilles or something like yeah. that, and it was, like, borderline intentional. We can't Ooh. speak to that, but... You just did. He walked away <laughs> saying you should have took your fr- foot off the base, so... Yeah, I mean, no, it, um, it, it was definitely intentional. Yeah. Yeah, Masco, if you're watching. 
<laughs> not happy. <laughs> we know. <laughs> Big brother not happy. Yeah. Big brother, you guys are. What's the? Yeah, uh, yeah. older. Yeah, By a year. A year. Okay. Yeah. So he's got another year left in the. Uh, he's probably gonna be a beast next year on the court, huh? Yeah, he will be. Oh That's, yeah, for kinda, sure. It kind of was this year already. Oh yeah. Um, and uh, is he excited to play a year without you? You think? Probably. Pave his own way yeah. a little bit. <laughs> he probably <laughs> is excited. What was the? I think I think I've asked you this before, but it's a it's a good uh, story because I can just picture you guys having battles in like the parking lot. Uh, Sports court. Driveway. We, <laughs> we were talking about this yesterday. Someone asked if we ever played one on one, and we used to, but not too much anymore. Yeah. Um, like we usually <laughs> just like go and like get our own workouts in, and then sometimes um, like get shots up with each other, like feed each other. Yeah. We're, we tend to want to like not go at each other. Yeah. Could be Aww. like a. <laughs> They're both really competitive. <laughs> yeah. My competitive kids. Could get too Mike's competitive. getting all sentimental. Uh, <laughs> brothers um was it, does he ever so he's a year younger does he ever bring like his uh like his crew like close friends that played ball and like kind of challenge your older uh-huh. guys or i mean you guys are all kind of really one group now it's since really the playing. same group of kids yeah it's all the yeah, same we group. just show up with um most of the kids who are on the basketball younger team. days maybe maybe i'm thinking more like middle school do you ever get challenged oh. from the uh <laughs> young whippersnappers uh, never never <laughs> they, w- they wouldn't dare challenge <laughs> <us>. <laughs> yeah. what's the uh mike what's the biggest difference between uh this you know, baseball squad and like the hockey locker room. I, I know it's two very different sports. And uh, yes, keep it clean, please. I can already see your. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what is the biggest difference though? Two very different sports, two different attitudes toward it. But oh, um, I think the baseball team, since it's like a smaller like roster, I think we're a little bit closer, and like much more like supportive of everyone. Like yeah. one through, uh, what is there? Fifteen guys. Seventeen, sixteen. I think we have fifteen this year. One through fifteen. Whereas hockey, there was like twenty, or there was like twenty-five kids on the team, so it's yeah. a lot harder to like bring everyone together. Yeah. So that, that's what I really like about this team. Like everyone supports each other, and there's also like cool relationships. There's like the football kids, basketball kids, like like hockey, golf. Like everyone comes together, and it's yeah. all these like unique relationships that come. What is the breakdown? You got. Because you guys got to make. Did you play, Tom? Did you play any other sports the season before? Winter sports? Yeah, you yeah. Were, football, play, yeah. I played okay, football. Okay, you're a football player. Yep. So you got to mix it. We got football, basketball, and hockey in the house. And you guys, what's the breakdown like team wise? How many football guys are playing baseball? Um, probably like half our rosters. Football guys. Plays football. What? Yeah. And basketball. There's what me, Parker, Archie. What does Archie play? And w- and Nick White. And Nick White. Okay. Yeah. What, what oh, is that? What, Fel- Felner, Robert, Jack Felner, Felner, and um, Owen Roberts too. Okay, both they're both freshmen. Yeah. Okay. They made the team this year as yeah. freshmen. Gotcha. Couple freshmen, very good. And hockey guys? Um, we got Ty Coglin and Archer. Uh, Ryan Archer and Tony Lucci. Tommy Green. Tommy Green. Yeah. Um, yeah, maybe forgetting. I don't think anyone. What is Ty. it? I got Ty. Yeah. So you can, you can apologize later if you. <laughs> Um, yeah, but it, it's it's nice, like, the younger kids who – there's a lot of sophomores who played football, and they all come in with, like, a really good work yeah. ethic. And yeah. pretty much from all the sports, they come come yeah. to baseball. What uh, what position does Archie play? Uh, Archie's shortstop. Yeah, he's shortstop. So he's shortstop. Yeah, he's an athletic dude. Yeah. What a shot he made in the – did you go to the basketball game? Yeah. yeah. I was there, too. You guys were oh, all yeah, there. I hope you'd all be there. Yeah. I know Casey was there. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what was that like, being on the floor for that? That was so cool. Like, I remember, um, like – rushing the glass like trying to tip out you know if he missed it trying to get another shot and then i just saw it go in and then i think i just like raised my arms yeah (laughs) because did you could you tell it looked good right away i don't know if i i don't think i watched it out of his hands i just knew that he was getting a shot up and like first thing i thought of was to rebound now that play I, i had your coach on right after the day after that game that wasn't designed for him right no it was yeah it was designed for me but the way it it like it worked out yeah like there was no hesitation in how it turned out so you wouldn't yeah. have thought that it it wasn't designed for yeah. Archie, who made the pass somebody made a good pass there. jake robertson i think robertson yeah yeah, yeah it was a, that was a great moment then he get the steal yeah, the next yeah. Position. steal after yeah. that that, that was finished too. sweet that was sequence that kid that he's, he's exciting as can be to watch huh? oh, yeah he's crazy yeah. yeah i love watching he's him he's a grinder one man full court press oh, it's yeah. funny too. He, 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 i catch him a little bit he talks a little bit out there too doesn't he 
Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's great kid. He's like the most polite dude in the world when he's in here. Yeah, he is. But he's. Uh, but I just noticed. I knew that um, the game you guys ended up losing to the that Drake team, who just unbelievably caught fire. Yeah. Um, that that uh, point guard there just could not miss. I, I saw him trying to get under the skin of the, the little freshman. Really. And uh, it happened right in front of me, and I was laughing. And uh, and I I remember being so impressed from the from the freshman. And who's do you remember his name? Uh, something like. Torres, I think. Yeah, I, I remember being just so impressed because the kid just, I was like, he's the real deal because he just yeah. looked at him, uh, George, and just looked at him yeah. and just didn't say a word. And then he hit the game. And, just, and, then, he hit the, and then he made a bunch of shots down yeah. the stretch. So, um, But yeah, that was, a, that was a fun basketball team that you guys had this year. Yeah, for sure. Um, very fun to watch. The uh, As far as the baseball squad goes, how um, what do you need? How many wins do you need to get into the tournament? Ten. Ten. There's 20 total. Good. All right. So tr- you guys are trying to get there in like the next, what, t- three weeks? Hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not get into that yeah. pressure. Yeah. This is a weird season, too, because once you get on that back end, like that's why I, most people think you have no chance when you go three and ten, because you start dealing with like proms and yes. all, what else is there? Graduation, yeah. you know, all that stuff that happens. Senior it's week. a distracting kind of season, baseball mm-hmm. season. That's true. Are you guys already distracted? Or? <laughs> no, we're think, just really focused. Nah. Yeah. yeah, really focused? Yeah. All right. No college, uh, no, no, no jump shots being taken right now this time of year. Uh, I mean, <laughs> a few here and there. Yes. <laughs> how do you? How can you not make the throw to first, but you can like just have one of the best jump shots in the Cape Ann League here? You have no. It's like Cape a, Ann it's League a, history. It's Cape a, Ann League history. It's yes, a, there you it's go. a pitcher's thing. I don't know. I kind of like. I kind of like it at this thing. point. You, uh, you like having the yips, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. That's fine. You don't want them in golf. I had them in golf one year. Oh. It was bad. My guys were Mike's probably had them before. Oh, yeah, you're a golfer, Mike. Yeah, you ever had the Yips in golf? Oh, uh, yeah, the Shanks, you know. <laughs> no, the Shanks are different. That's, that's, <laughs> I, I don't mind. Nothing that. worse than the Hazel. The what? <laughs> the Hazel. The Hazel? Ha- yeah, what is that? The, the, like, all right, you have a golf club. It's the heel of the golf club. Oh. So if you hit it in the Shanks, like, right. Oh, okay. Yeah, <laughs> yeah everybody knows a bad golf shot. That can happen to the best of us. But the worst, like, I'm talking about standing over these like putts and like you know you play play your buddies for you know whatever oh yeah matches. Can't control and it's it's like yeah it's like you're you I mean there were putts like this long that my guys were like I gotta see you make it I can't I can't give you this. yeah and it's a bad and then you grind over it for like way too long yeah it's brutal it's a bad thing yeah they're short putts that they're testers yeah I'm over it now I think uh, <laughs> I got new but new putters yeah sometimes cost me a lot of money yeah you, sometimes you have to do that it's a men- it was completely a mental thing but but yeah one season. Yep. I remember one one of my uh, my my younger cousin, way younger, was was a good good little golfer. I had I had one of those putts before, and he goes, and "This was a low point for me." He goes, uh, uh, uh. "He has struggled from this distance before." Yeah, it's tough. This is not good. I almost had a hole in one the other day. You know. You did? Yeah, it's kind of a weird thing to say because he almost is like, whatever. Uh huh. Everybody's almost had one, but it was like it was, I kind of thought I made it. Where were you playing? Uh, Sagamore and Linfield. Oh yeah, we just we drove just by that. Wait, 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 just was drove by. Yeah. <laughs> was yeah. it the front nine? Yeah, it was eight. Oh, that's kind of a long hole. It's like one. I hit a five iron. Yeah. Yeah, it's a long one. It's a good. Point. With houses in the back. Yeah, that or at least that big house. Yeah. Like, yeah is that yeah. a house? Or like so. a condo. <laughs> it's like yeah, huge. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I was uh, I was too busy eyeing the flag stick to notice that. But, <laughs> but uh, it didn't go in. Did you ever have one? I haven't. You're so young. No. <laughs> My dad, who's like... He's got six years ahead of him. Six years ago. Are you playing 60. college golf? No, no, no. Says no. 60. Oh, 60, 60. yeah. <laughs> uh, that's the great thing about yeah. golf, isn't it? Yep. Play forever. Do you guys play? I used to. I do, yeah. yeah. Are you on the golf team, though? No, I, I play football, so... Oh, right. So yeah. It's fall, the yes, fall sport, that's right. I did you, play football. Recreationally, yeah. though, you like it? Yes, yeah. What are you playing football? Um, I was the quarterback for the first half of the season, but I got moved over for to wide receiver. Like, oh. I, I played wide receiver um, my first three years, and then gotcha. Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, that's exciting. You uh, they they throw into it a lot. Uh, I mean, we're like a running team. So. <laughs> <laughs> that's the only way you can answer that. We kind of run it a lot. All right. Well, very good. Uh, you guys have ten more minutes in here. Take one quick break and come back. Yeah, sure. Everybody good? All right. We'll come right back. Newburyport baseball guys. You guys all captains. Yeah. yeah. These are the three captains. Yeah. Are yeah. there more? No. Nah. Nope. These are the three. All right, we got the three new report baseball captains in the house. Much more with these guys. When we get back, my name is Drew Moholland. It's Afternoon Drive on Joppa Radio. All right, welcome back to Afternoon Drive on Joppa Radio. My name is Drew Moholland. Happy Thursday to you. Weekend almost here. Uh, joined by three great guests Mike Toomey from left to right, K 
Casey McLaren and Thomas Murphy, the baseball captains of Newburyport Baseball. Uh, and, of course, a big thanks to Tyler Newfell and David Kramer producing radio and TV, respectively, today. And hello to everybody streaming on YouTube uh, and uh, NCM Hub as well. Um, Tyler, what do you always tell me to promote to? SoundCloud, right? SoundCloud and YouTube. So- SoundCloud and the YouTube channel. So yeah, that's SoundCloud right. SoundCloud is NCM Hub. NCM Hub. Is the SoundCloud and Port Media is the no, YouTube. No spaces. No spaces on Port Media. Go search it. It's good. Oh yeah, one Saturday other promotion. One other programming note. Opera on Saturday. One p.m. One p.m. to get you ready for Easter. Nothing like some good old fashioned opera to get you ready for Easter. Is there an Easter theme? You don't know. That's uh, <laughs> fine. You guys got Easter plans? Baseball. Yep. Baseball. baseball. Yeah. Actually on Easter? No. Um, no, you well can't go anywhere though. We have, we have oh, you get game, Saturday game yeah. Monday. We'll practice some. Yeah. You, wait, what will you do? We don't know. You don't know. <laughs> we don't know. We have a game Monday. So it's up, we, it's we up in the air. You have a game Monday. And yeah. did you say you had a something Saturday too? Is that practice Saturday? Uh, we practice Saturday because our game Saturday got moved to Monday. Oh, uh, okay, gotcha. Oh, we'll probably be in the gym though because bad weather. Yeah. What's up, Mike? Are you going to all the practices too? Yeah. Really? That's that's dedication. Yeah, well, that's a good time. Team player. Uh, every now and then, you might be able to be like, listen, coach, I'm just going to, uh, I got other things to do. He doesn't imagine. even want to do that, though. <laughs> You're all in. Well, they're all, all my friends, so it's yeah. like, it's a good time. Mike's right. awesome. Yeah. That is good. Yeah. That is a really cool thing to hear. Did you want to elaborate on how awesome Mike is? I, it's, I, I felt like you did. I felt like there was more there. I kind of liked it. It was I'm, good. No. <laughs> yeah, enough has been said. He's, he's a great leader. A great leader. There yeah. you go. All right. On and, we'll, on and off the field. Thank you, Thomas. Yeah. That's very sweet. Guys, it's getting romantic in here. Uh, <laughs> the, uh, wh- who's like the team jokester this year? Who's like the guy that keeps Probably like loose? Walker. Yeah, who's Walker? Is that, that a first or last name? Uh, I'm not gonna try his last yeah. name. That's his first, first name. name. Barkevich, <laughs> Walker Barkevich. He's definitely number eight. Or is I, it I thought it was Barkevich. No, no, it's spelled Barkevich, Bar-Kevich. but it's pronounced Barkevich. Barkevich, yeah. You said that with so much confidence. I'm not even gonna argue with you. Okay. He's he's a hundred percent our team like jokester. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> what what, what, what uh, what's his what's his go to thing? Is it just on the field? Now? He's just like a like a, a loose silly kind of guy. Loose. Yeah. Okay. But then w- once like the game starts like. It's, yeah. It changes. He's Same thing with serious. football, too. <laughs> it changes like a little less goofy. Yeah. <laughs> like once the game starts for him. Is that, I, like, I think you kind of need that, though, don't you? Exactly. You need that guy? We do. Yeah. Um, yeah. He, he was like a lineman this year for football. Yeah. And um, he he can be like a running back on any other team, but just like he he took that role and like just went with it, and that kind of explains his personality. could be a running back, but he's a lineman? Yeah. I mean, like he – RT team, Newport's not the biggest school, so <laughs> – yeah, he can't, he'll he'll just go with the flow. It is weird high school, high school football, it's pre- like with the numbers down. Like there's a lot of that, right? It's like guys playing like being forced into other positions and stuff. Yeah, but um, it's just yeah, yeah. I mean, like we don't really have that many like two like big like like fat big lines. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> I do know what you mean. Walk, yeah. Walker's like the strongest yeah. kid probably in like, the Cape Ann League. Yeah. Like so you just kind of so. need big toughness, right? Yeah, or at least somewhat big. Um, what's the uh, fo- what is the deal with the football numbers? I know they're down with all the. I mean, is that to your tribute that's a is it the concussion thing or what? What is it? Uh, I honestly have no idea. Yeah, have you played your whole life? Yep, I played since third grade with Casey. He was, we've been on the same team. Okay. Yeah. Casey, big football guy. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I stopped before high school. Casey yeah. stopped when he found that jump shot and found out <laughs> found that he could dunk. You know what? I'm good. Hit that, gro- <laughs> hit that growth spurt. <laughs> yeah. When did you hit that growth spurt? Um. It kind of was like steady over high school. You've always just been like yeah. tall yeah. guy, so yeah, guy. yeah. I'm probably done now. Now, yeah. The, actually, the first time Casey came in, I made a, I think I made a reference to like thinking that he was taller, mm-hmm. but he was in a sh- like the f- smaller chair of all oh. the other guys. I and remember I, that. Do you remember that? I was on the edge, I think. Yeah, yeah. yeah and you rolled with it pretty good because it hit me after the show. I was like, <laughs> oh, all right, he is tall, like I thought, because <laughs> like I, you guys beat me here, so I didn't see you walk in. Uh, so then when you guys left, I was like, oh, that makes so much more sense. <laughs> and then I was thinking to myself, that was cool of him to roll with it because he could have been like, what the hell are you talking about? <laughs> yeah, how tall are you? Six. Um, like six, six five and yeah. a little bit. Yeah. Oh, yeah, well, I guess I am, I am six five. Yeah. All right. Well, anyway, that's uh. So I apologize for that from three years ago or whatever that no was. Worries. No worries. <laughs> Probably not three years ago. Have we been on for three years? No. Two. Two uh, we started in 2017. All right, good. Very good. Um, two years. Oh, that's good. Uh, the So you got the team jokester. Do you guys do pasta parties and all that stuff? Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, we had one last night. Last night? Where yeah. was it? It was at my house. Your house? Yeah. So wait, do you have to do... There's like more pressure on you because you got the two, you got your brother. So like your parents really got to deliver. Yeah. Do they have uh, to do two pasta parties? No. Nah, well, so <laughs> maybe. Uh, yeah, it hasn't been addressed. Yeah, like if, if, if no one's offering to do one at the end of the year, maybe we will. But. That's funny. Those things are, I bet with a baseball team, those things are kind of tough to put on. It's a big roster. Well, yeah, no, I guess hockey's bad too. Yeah. Uh, one time, I had a sophomore year at a pasta party for hockey, and there was a table in every single room of my house to like fit. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's like insane. So it, now like the play is just to use the room above anchor. And oh, yeah. it's okay. like a, yeah, it's a good space to hang out. A lot of uh, a lot of parents going in that direction. Yeah, springtime you can probably do. Is this ever done? I actually don't remember doing this when I was in high school, so maybe it's not done. But I would think I'm like a big grill guy. I would think when the weather gets nice, you could do like outside. True. Does that ever happen? I feel like it doesn't. Oh uh, well, we were outside last night because yeah. Casey has a little basketball court at his house, so yeah. we're team knockout. It's the yeah. shocker of the century. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh, team knockout. Who won? Um, who do you think? We won? did a couple. We did a couple different. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, knockout's kind of weird, though. All right, who do you think won? Though? Who do I think won? I'm gonna, I'm gonna say Casey. Yeah. Right. <laughs> I won like one of the four. That, that silky jump shot. <laughs> Archie won like one or two. And then... I think I won. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> who won the other? I got a nice jump shot one? though. I'm not gonna. You lie. have a nice jump shot. Yeah. Like Walker okay. won the last right. one. This thing. <laughs> Thomas would like to speak more about his oh. jump shot. I'm uh, sorry. Um, no, uh, go, no, no, go ahead. You, you don't want to hear about <laughs> his jump shot. I'll, I'll speak about his jump shot. I used to play like one on one with Casey back in the day. I've beat him one time my was whole it? life, and it was on. Wow. Like a, it was on a mini hoop too. So, yeah. the the, only time. and the microphone is quickly pulled away. <laughs> that gives him no legitimacy. <laughs> <laughs> I would like to address this immediately. I'll let him have it though. He's talked about it a few times. So. <coughs> no, he's he, about he it enjoys it, obviously. Yeah. You were waiting all day to get that in, weren't you? Let's go off topic one moment here. <laughs> <coughs> Gonna go to his college games and tell that story. See that guy out there? Beat him. Yeah. Um, <laughs> that's funny. The uh, What's the difference between... I, I know Coach Clay very well. I don't know Coach Rowe at all, actually. I think I met him maybe once, but... Um, what's the what's the difference in uh, like philosophies? I know they're different sports, but like, what's the one thing that you feel, Casey, just jumps right off the bat? I didn't think about that. Yeah. Um, Tough question, huh? I don't know. Um. <laughs> How about you? Two? Like, give coach. him a second. How about, well, don't worry about Coach Clay. Do uh, you mean well, Coach Rowe? Um, oh, you want to do Coach Clay? Feel free. Go for it. Whatever you're in. Oh, uh, so Coach Rowe, like, he's very he's strict and has like high expectations. But he really cares, so yeah. like everyone can understand that and like play for him. See, that's kind of the coachy mean deal too, right? Yeah, similar, similarly, but like off the ice, coachy means like a really funny guy. Coach Rowe, like Still he's, he's, he's all he's all <laughs> yeah. business yeah. all the time. Yeah. That that's he's sort of a good business. way. All business all yeah. the time. Gotcha. May, uh, you get the occasional occasional laugh out of him. And he, he has to be really funny from the lab. There's a high yeah. bar on that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Give us your best material. What, do you, what, did, what got the laughs? It's really it's not even anything like funny. It's just something <laughs> that he finds funny that he'll laugh <laughs> at. Okay. <laughs> you, you don't remember that moment. It's not. It's not sticking with you. No. What made him laugh? No. I think it made him laugh today. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> that was, would be rare. Yeah. What was today's <laughs> conversation? Uh. Well, he was looking sharp in his back. Yeah, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I know this, So was. we walk into the locker room yeah, today. <laughs> and we, so there's like the coach's room and it's like a glass room. And we like walk by and we're like, what the heck? Like, Coach, <laughs> coach was wearing like baseball like uniform. Yeah. And like, you know, MLB managers do that. But like yeah, yeah. At high school, like some coaches do. But Coach Rowe is always a black pants, maroon shirt. So just like these were like clean white pants. So <laughs> it was pretty the funny. Same ones that we wear. It was pretty <laughs> funny. I mean, he looked, he, looked, he looked handsome. So. Is, he looked <laughs> handsome. Very, very, very nice. Well, well, well. He looked very handsome. Coach, you mean, by the way, is a very oh, underrated well. funny guy. Yeah, he is. I know people don't realize that off the, uh, you know, who are just watching from the stands. Yeah, they just think he's a yeller and screamer. But when I was that's only at the rink. Yeah. He's, he's, he always says he's a different person when he walks into the rink. Yeah. But I got to, I got to spend a lot of time with him when I was following you, uh, when I was calling your games more regularly and uh, very funny man yes. and a genuinely good guy. Um, which most of the coaches at Newburyport are? There's not really any. I haven't really met any jerks, which is good. Don't feel don't feel the need to correct me on that. That would be bad for you. Uh, <laughs> that's Newburyport but, hires the best. Yeah, it's a good group of coaches. So so that is good. Um, all right, let's do a little rapid fire since uh, it's coming to the end of the show here. Let's start with Thomas because we don't know him as well. 
kind of got to know you guys pretty well on the other side. So, uh, favorite movie, Thomas Murphy. We know it's not Major League. Uh, Step Brothers, probably. Step Brothers? Yeah. All right. I didn't really like it. You didn't, you didn't like Step Brothers? I know. Damn. Yeah. Well, you didn't see Major League, Mark, so. Can't <laughs> <swear on> the <laughs> he, he said damn. He's fine. <laughs> he said damn before, didn't he? Yeah. Oh, right, don't make this about me. Okay. Oh, okay. You got caught up. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just he's kidding with you. It's fine. <laughs> Case, uh, Casey, have you seen Step Brothers? I have. Do yeah. you like the Do you like the movie? Yeah, it's hysterical. Okay. Hysterical, yeah. yeah. Right. Maybe it's just yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I, uh, Mike, love it. Um, yeah, it's funny. Okay. Like, you can. It's usually like on TV a lot. So if like you turn it, you can get a good laugh. Yeah, you know what else is on TV a lot? Major League. I haven't I've se- ha- seen haven't haven't seen it. Go watch the movie. He'll Can't enjoy. Say it. I've ever heard of it either. <laughs> what? Yeah. What? Wild thing, Rick Vaughn. You make my heart sing. Nah. Dun, 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 dun. It doesn't ring a bell. Does. <laughs> wild thing. I almost feel like you're like messing with me. If I didn't know you, I think you're like messing with me. Wait, is that the song me. Wild Thing? Am I not singing the song Wild Thing? Um, is it? Well, like, yes. I don't know. Like, That's you, what it's if from. You played it, then I, I don't even it. know what that is. He comes yeah, out. So. Wild Thing. There you go. Yeah. There you go. You I know make my heart sing. Do you want to sing? Keep going. It's fine. Nah, I'm not going to save the very no. thing. Awesome. You know it's a good show when people are fighting for the microphone. It's a good thing. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Back to you, Thomas. Uh, favorite TV show? Um, the Office, probably. Good call there. I'm with you. All right. Now we're back on track. Favorite food? Uh, a nice cheeseburger. Okay. Favorite sport to watch? Football. Okay. I like those. Those but are good answers. Playoff, yeah. playoff Bruins hockey is like very physical. I like watching. There you that. go. That is the best. That's that's, yes. that's outstanding. Quick note. Quick note. Okay. So Bruins were playing last night. We're over the McLarens. Oh yeah. Hockey's just like banned at their house for some reason. You don't watch that. Really? <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. Only basketball. That is really funny. Can I learn more about this? I guess. Uh, <laughs> Casey <I> re- referred <laughs> to <laughs> hockey as like a dying sport and like no, I, it's I not followed around. Okay. America. Well, I didn't say that. I said. People don't care about it in other parts of the country. That's why I said. Well, that's not true. But it's it's not right. true. I guess I have to defend myself <laughs> from the spot. But yeah, to, to clarify, we're a basketball family. And <laughs> basketball there were like 15 <laughs> people at the house, and if like two of them wanted to watch the Bruins, and I was like, you know what? Like, I'm sorry. There's there's the Celtics on. The Sox are on. Like, that's just number three, and it's just not happening. There's, there's a lot of there's a lot of families like that. Yeah. I uh, there's a lot. I know. I can see. My, I can see. Mike's just not even comfortable with family. the conversation. <laughs> the, the, well, yeah. I uh, there are there are. It's true. I'm not. I'm not one of them, Mike. I'm with you. I was watching the Bruins. I wanted to be watching the Bruins. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're not bitter about this or anything, huh? Well, a little bit. I mean, they scored two goals in the first period. We didn't even get to see. <laughs> All right. So you're next busy time. you watching Kyrie drop forty. <laughs> Kyrie was good last yeah. night. Thirty-seven. That, that man can find space, can he? <laughs> Yeah. Um, well, might I suggest to you the uh, the uh, Nesson app? Oh, that would have been a good idea. Yeah. I could can you stream? stream? You yeah. Can you stream on it? Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. I'll be good for next year. You could have. <laughs> <laughs> we'll pause yeah. the party next year. Oh, uh, college. There. Yeah, in college, yeah. So you yeah. can watch Massachusetts games. So. Absolutely. Oh, yeah, because yeah. Murph's going all the way to Arizona. Arizona. Congratulations. Thank you. You, yeah. University of Arizona? Yes. That, yeah. seems, that seems like a lot of fun. Just playing yeah. ball. Uh, yeah. <laughs> some pickup, yeah. Some pickup ball, yeah. I, I think you'll find some other stuff to do out there. It's a, uh, I know some people who've gone to Arizona, and it's pretty fun. I hear. Awesome. Make sure you do your work. <laughs> I will. The weather's n- weather's nice. <laughs> Easy to get lost out there. Um, Mike, did you make a college? Oh uh, yeah, I'm going to Babson. Nice, staying close. Businessman. Yeah, <laughs> maybe. Very smart. Very smart kid. Very smart both kid. These, wow. Both these kids are very smart. Look at you. Tom's good at like putting you guys on the spot and then giving you the compliments. It's good. Yeah. <laughs> Makes you feel uncomfortable for a second, and then it's... Oh, thank you, Thomas. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> the third thank you, Thomas, from, from Mike. So, Babson, good for you. Yeah. Excellent. You excited? Uh, yeah. It kind of feels... Does it feel right? I mean, you guys are probably upset to leave high school because you've had such a great you know, sports and athletic career, but uh, does it feel like the right time to kind of make that next jump? Yeah, like especially in like school. Like school was getting like really boring. Like sports are all, they're all fun, but like the school you're just like oh I just a little like, drag. Yeah, yeah, you just want to like start studying like what you're gonna do. I remember like, feeling that way too. Yeah. Same with you, Casey. You ready to uh, play yeah. some college ball? Yeah, he said it perfectly. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. Ah. Uh, <laughs> thank you, Casey. Yeah. <laughs> Very good. All right, boys. Well, actually, we only did you rapid fire. We're gonna make these really quick. Favorite uh, sure. uh, favorite uh, favorite basketball player. Oh man. Um. How do you not know that question? I'll skip. 
Skip it. Yeah. All right, we'll, we'll go back to it. Favorite, cl- <laughs> favorite class? Favorite class? Calc. Favorite teacher? Favorite sport to watch other than basketball and baseball? Not hockey. Football. Football. Yeah. Favorite basketball player? Jason Tatum. Ooh, came up with Tatum. Yeah. Good dig. Ooh. Big shot last Ooh. night. Ooh. All right, Mike, we're ending with you. Favorite, sh- favorite I want to know favorite movie. Uh, that was the one I was hoping you weren't going to ask because like, I don't really watch movies. Favorite TV movies. show? Um, mm, I guess The Office always cracks me up. All right, favorite athlete? Uh, uh, Not Shark Tank? <laughs> <laughs> I love Shark Tank. Good favorite, job. I don't know. Favorite athlete? I don't know. Um. You guys want to help me? Like out? a ball time? You know, he's, he's a big D Wade anything. guy. <laughs> <laughs> it's Dwayne Wade? Of all time, or <laughs> yeah, I don't know. It, you just leave it open. Uh, that's a tough one. Yeah. That's like every sport. How about favorite? Like, how about favorite uh, musician, Mike? Musician. Or favorite artist? Um, I'm not like a huge music guy. As like, good as you are at all the other stuff on the radio show, you're very bad at rapid fire. <laughs> oh, I, I, I was hoping we were gonna run out of time. <laughs> <laughs> and then we'll, you know what? It's a good time to end on that note because now we have. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Guys, that was a lot of fun. Uh, pleasure as always. Uh, good luck to the rest of the baseball season. We'll have you on when you make the tournament because you're going to do that this year. Awesome. Uh, uh, Mike Toomey, Casey McLaren, Thomas Murphy. Big thanks, Tyler Newfell, David Kramer, producers for the day. My name is Drew Mulholland. Happy Easter. Have a good weekend, everybody. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye now.